What is the current global container shipping situation? The current logistics challenges aroused due to several factors, not just one particular problem. Everyone who used to ship goods smoothly is now facing the highest freight rates and longer unpredictable delivery time. And this is the transport cost that plays a vital role in successful deals nowadays. There are multiple interlocking factors causing this, there is the demand spike on particular markets, the capacity shortage, the equipment shortage, and there's congestion in seaports. Simply put, the increased demand and pandemic caused the lack of manpower and equipment, this caused the port congestion, and the port congestion causes the vessel shortage, which influenced the demand. Let's consider every part of this complex problem. Lack of equipment. Also sometimes considered as container shortage, however this is just a part of the lacking equipment. In the United States, COVID-19 has reduced warehouse turnover efficiency and delayed the return of empty containers. For example, in China the containers are in extreme shortage. Every three exported containers can only return one to China, capacity cannot be supported, and the sea freights are soaring. All equipment types remain tight across Asia, especially shortage of empty containers in key locations. Demand spike. Demand boom happened in some trades only, along with the demand for equipment that led to equipment shortage, it could not be fully met. Even though the demand was expected to grow irrespective to the pandemic, it is a significant element making a difference to the current situation. On the one hand, if the vessels are not there, the problem of equipment shortage cannot be fixed, so the product's availability becomes limited. On another hand, it is due to the huge demand that the congestion in North American and European ports has restricted the return of empty containers in time, and purchasing and producing more containers cannot quickly solve the problem of container imbalance. Market players would probably better adapt to deal with the current supply and demand situation as something that is not going to go away overnight. Vessel shortage. While shippers are struggling to accommodate consumer demand, Carriers are having difficulty moving record-setting amounts of inventory, which is causing severe and consistent delays in releasing the vessels as well. In May 2021 global overseas shipment schedules are just 30.9% reliable. Port congestion. Port congestion is the main factor slowing down the vessels, and it differs from region to region. Compared to the early 2021, the terminal congestion is slowly improving in the Middle 